Check it out. With the release of firmware version 1.2.6, your Sentinel controller is now capable of running both the Autobox 1L and Autobox 3L tube cleaning systems. This video will cover the procedure for setup and operation of the Autobox 1L tractor and compass positioner with Sentinel technology. After powering the controller on, use the left joystick to click New Job in the main menu. Check the oil level in your power hub and click OK. You will now see an equipment screen where you can select the equipment you are using. There are currently three choices. Click the left joystick to toggle through them. The first choice is for using a lightweight positioner with a 3L tractor. The second choice is for using a lightweight positioner with a 1L tractor. And the third choice is for using a compass positioner with a 1L tractor. Choose compass positioner with a 1L tractor and click done. You can now step through the job configuration steps in the same way you would when using the Autobox 3L tractor. You will notice that some of the steps are already checked off because they do not apply to the setup of the Autobox 1L tractor. There is one notable difference in the setup when you are using a compass positioner. There is an additional calibration step required for the auto move function to work correctly. The calibration starts off the same as it does for the lightweight positioner. You depress the actuation lever on the back of the controller and click the go button. The compass positioner will make four different moves to measure the mechanical characteristics of the motors. Upon successful completion, you will see that the test is passed and you can click done to continue. The display will instruct you to install the calibration stick and drive to position 1. The calibration stick included with the system will connect to the standard mount or the spider plate mount included with the confined space kit. Attach the calibration stick to the mount you are using. Then drive the tractor so that the guide tube lines up with the hole labeled 1. Use the right joystick to drive the tractor in any direction. If you need to make more precise movements to align with the calibration stick, click down on the center of the right joystick to enter nudge mode. In this mode, each time you push the joystick in any direction, the compass will move in very small increments to make the alignment easier. To exit nudge mode, click down on the right joystick again to return to normal operation. When you have aligned the guide tube with position 1, click Done. Now the display will instruct you to drive to position 2. When you have aligned the guide tube with position 2, click Done. Now you will identify one full tube row to set the horizontal axis of the system. The display will instruct you to drive to the far left tube of one of the rows on the tube sheet. Select a long row for more accurate calibration. It is important that you start and end on the same row. Once you are positioned on a tube at the far left of the tube sheet, click Done. Now drive to the farthest tube on the right in the same row and click Done. The calibration is now complete and you will see the calibration values on screen. The display will instruct you to remove the calibration stick. The remainder of the job setup is identical to the procedure for a 3L system on a lightweight positioner.